Hey, happy Monday, everybody. It's Sean from High Level. I just wanted to jump in here and show you a new feature that just went live. So this was put uh, live as a part of our Twilio ISV uh, sort of certification, uh, but it's something that will benefit everybody. It is mandatory and required uh, uh, by Twilio for that ISV, so that's why it's now in place. Uh, but when you go to sign in now, we have uh, implemented 2FA. So 2FA you might be familiar with. Uh, it's the, uh, basically when you try to log in, you're going to get a security code here. So I'm going to go ahead in this case, you, I can see the email that's on file for my user. Obviously that's the one I just tried to log in with. And I can also see that, uh, there's a, a phone number as well. In my case, I'm going to just basically hit send code to phone and hit send security code. And then I should get a code on my phone. Just a sec. Okay. Sure enough. So in my case, it's seven, five, two, five, one, seven, and then confirm and that's it, I'll be logged in, no big deal, just like normal. Now, um, that makes things a lot more secure, which is a cool byproduct of this. I know no one likes 2FA, I personally don't like it at all, but um, in this day and age, in order to make sure accounts are more secure, um, especially when we're dealing with really important data, um, like we all are for all of you, I think it's important that we have it in place, um, but in our case, Tulio mandated it, so <laughs> today's the day. Um, we're gonna go ahead also and take a look at a couple of changes in the keys section. So if you go into settings and then you go over into uh, API keys, you'll see here that uh, we also rolled out brand new keys and the keys actually have some additional items rel uh, related to the 2FA rollout. Um, and so basically all the addition, the current old keys, quote unquote, will still work, except um, you can't create users with them. If you want to get a new key, you can simply come over here and you can click regenerate key. It will actually, if you type confirm and you hit yes reset, it'll it'll give you a brand new key and that new key will have those additional 2FA features on them and you can actually use the full API. I won't uh, reset this, well actually I'll go ahead and reset this and I'll do it again um, just because this will expose the key. So this is kind of a, don't, sh don't shoot a video like this, <laughs> right? So, oh actually, never mind. They already figured this out for me. So you can't actually even see the new key. You actually have to copy it here, which is awesome. But as you can see, once I, I, I rotate it, the old tag is off. Now the full API functionality is available again. And so now you're up and running and obviously you can do that uh, up here uh, as well. Uh, by create with the agency keys, you'll just create a new one. Uh, and the agency keys are only available, of course, if you're on the pro account. And then again, if you're if you wanted to do this at the location level, you could also do it at the location level. Uh, for those of you who aren't on the pro account, it's just as easy. So we're going into the location itself. And in this case, we're still going into settings. Uh, we're going to be going into here. Here's the API key. And again, same rotate regenerate button, same same process, no big deal. So anyways, API key updates and 2FA. So hope all of you are having an awesome morning so far. And as usual, if you have any questions, let us know. Thanks.